Defense Prime BAE Systems has introduced its adaptable strike frigate, ASF, concept designed to European naval market at the Euronaval Exhibition at Paris Le Bourget on 18th of October, with the platform itself centered around modularity and autonomous systems. Chief among its target programs will be the UK Type 32 effort, which entered the concept phase on 21st of September this year. BAE Systems will seek to deliver an outline business case, setting out preliminary thoughts regarding the ASF, in parallel with the multi-role support ship program. We see a requirement for system deployment globally, said Steve Hart, head of UK business development for maritime and land at BAE Systems. Fluctuations in international financial sustainability are a consideration during the design process, and to balance affordability with the needs of the ship, Hart estimates the ship's size to be 130 meters, and to weigh 6,000 tons. We see autonomous systems entering the battle space and bringing additional complexity, which can only be countered with additional mass, added Hart, describing the changing threat environment and potential for global deployment as factors driving the design process towards a modular framework. We looked at how you deliver that flexibility, complexity, to the battle space, to achieve warfare effect, but also how you rapidly change the role of the platform. The ASF is designed to operate as part of a literal response group, or independently, as circumstances demand. The containerized mission modules enable rapid reconfiguration for operations. We're talking about a protean force that has a much more flexible function, with effect delivered from autonomous systems, and situational awareness on those platforms being greatly extended through the use of desegregated sensors, said Hart. The ASF has been optimized for use with autonomous systems including autonomous underwater vehicles, and uncrewed surface vehicles and uncrewed aerial vehicles. The command and control structures are designed to be able to operate effectively with different integrated systems, requiring a new approach to warship design. As the ASF is still in the concept phase, any build strategy would be driven by the requirements of the program, and the location of the build site is not yet determined, but BAE Systems has work guaranteed in its Glasgow yards until the mid-2030s.